to you guys. So this week it is decorating for fall week. I missed last week. I had to go back to meetings for my work and I did do um, some recycling picking, trash picking, and I went to an estate sale where I purchased a few items and yard sale this weekend for me was a total flop. Um, either overpriced and not what I'm looking for. Sometimes that happens. I've been really fortunate, so I'm clowning my blessing. Blessings, because I had a, quite a few. So we're just gonna go ahead and get started with um, recycling, trash picking. Um, the first thing is I found this frame and um, it has two hooks, one at the top, one at the bottom. And so even though it has nothing in it, I thought this would be great if I can just put something in there and do like a welcome or um, it can even go like this. So I picked it up because I saw some potential. There was also a window frame, uh, a window with six panels. He was already sprayed for Christmas. I actually gave that away already to someone that was looking for one. So why not? Uh, one of the items that I did find was this cute little toy box. I am outside today just to film this so I can put everything away and it's empty inside but I thought it was kind of cool looking. So I went ahead and picked that up. It is from a Fisher, Fisher Price. So got that this trash picking. Okay these were unusual and I think I'm thinking there are going to be a couple of flea market craft sale. They're going to combine the two. And I think I saw it October time frame. So I picked up six of these. I think somebody made these for a wedding cake maybe or cupcake. It has like the little stands. So I thought they're pretty big. I thought, how about making a nice sign like my clock and maybe these items I can make to sell at that flea market or whatever. Put a little hook on the back and I think that would work. It's pretty thick, but I think it's still really neat to have. So there are six of these that I picked up off the side of the road. I wasn't going to pick it up at first because I wasn't sure what it is, but then I saw potential. So I went ahead and got them. Um, the next thing I did get was this cute ooh, little lamp um, that's just going to be a giveaway to someone. Um, it's for a little girl's room, but I just thought that was kind of neat looking on the side of the road. The next item I picked up on the side was a poster and it says it's the Kansas City Chiefs go Super Bowl winners last year. so. Um, just got it because it's the Kansas City Chief and I live in Kansas City. So that was there. Next item I picked up, and we know that these can be quite pricey, are these eraser boards. Um, looked like somebody had written with a reel, they said yes. Maybe they said yes to getting married, I don't know. But the hooks are still in the back, so side of the road, not bad deal right there. I'm going to stretch out. These were on the side of the road as well. There was a ton of trim. I like to pick these up sometimes in case I have a little project that I can do. Like, let's say this framed, I could put, um, a, you know, finish the top with it or finish the bottom. Just little thoughts like that that I picked this up. And two more Barbies. They're looking pretty rough. But um, I saw on Facebook, they had like the five minute craft, how you can put the dolls hair in some solution and they'll help it out. But I'm not gonna keep the dolls, I'm actually gonna dress them and give them away. And that was that for trash picking. Oh, and exactly the chair I'm sitting on. That was also next to the road and I picked it up. It's a nice sturdy chair. And I thought, well, it's a cute little country chair. So I picked that up. The next place I went to was a primitive home, country home. They had so much stuff that it was a little bit overwhelming for me. And some of it looked like it had been there for a long time, like it had not moved. And I was having a difficult time with the prices. I thought it was priced up a little high. 
but I still picked up a few things from them there goes the poster this is a old dictionary and of course I'm not wearing my Greek glasses I'm wearing sunglasses let's see here if I can make this out 1935 I do this it's when you're nearsighted or whatever you can't see you get stuck like this and you're supposed to see but it's a 1935 old dictionary I just thought I love the texture on it so I thought I would pick this up and it was 35% off at this yard sale I mean at this estate sale the next item I picked up was this cute little wooden box or tray it was six dollars I debated on it but it, it is quite filthy that was my other thing things were really filthy like hadn't been dusted so it, sometimes that's not attractive to me but I still picked this up because I love I just love the tray and the next item that I did pick up and again it's quite dusty it's this little cupboard and it does have a little swing door okay it opened while I was there there it goes and again it's quite filthy and but it was twenty four dollars and it came down to eighteen the craftsmanship on this is really nice and I can tell that it's old I'm gonna put it down and it's quite heavy too so um Usually I look for better bargains than that, but I thought for the price and it's a old farmhouse piece, I went ahead and pick it up for $18. So that is my haul for this weekend. It's not very big. Like I said, the, um, my husband and I actually went together. A couple of the yard sale, it looked like rain that morning, did not open, which sometimes doesn't make me happy because I make a route to where we're going. And in a couple of ones, it was uh, mostly girl clothes or um, they already had a sale on Friday. So most of dishes and stuff like that was gone. But I'm looking for specific things. I actually make a list of what I'm looking for. So that way I just don't go crazy. And other than that, there were a couple of places. This one lady at a fold down leaf table with two chairs for $5. I had my car. So I couldn't bring it home but then I have to also think where am I gonna put these items at and I thought it would be something nice for when our sign gets an apartment whenever that may be <laughs> but no seriously I love getting furniture like that because you never know when somebody might use it for five dollars but I if we would have had the truck we would have brought it but I didn't want to go all the way back to go get it later on so we just said our fault and then there was a big base table with a glass on top and they wanted like $15 and it was at least a $9,800 table again cannot put it in my small car sometimes it's good to bring my car sometimes it's not because it when I bring my car it kind of lets me scale back a little bit but that was the finds this weekend so treasure hunting was still great for me I still love the hunt I still love my date with my husband and um, I think it rained yesterday morning so um, trash picking was a little uh, as well so anyways thank you so much for watching my channel I'm coming back this week with a whole new set of fall decorating um, I found it a little difficult for me because I'm used to just going and for me to stop and explain sometimes it's hard but I hope that you will enjoy the formal diamond room part of the decor which will be uploaded after this video thank you so much for subscribing please like comment share subscribe and I will see you next time as we do treasure hunting